guys. I'm going to put this uh, TIG rest to use. I'm making two more pieces of tube with uh, nuts that I've got to braise on. And uh, these will be welded to make a cross piece, which I think I described previously. So, just to show that this is pretty darn useful, get the height right. And we should be good to go. Make it a bit easier than, uh, you know, having lumps of wood there. <laughs> I didn't want to bore you with putting this thing together, but I've managed it now. So it's just, say, a, a T-piece, two pieces of that, one inch tube. Uh, we've got two, two bolts for the vertical and just one bolt for the... Uh, cross piece. I'll just put that in place. Okay, I'll put this on and uh, this is the idea obviously, it's just just another another option. So you can have as much or as little bar as you want there. So basically with that and this uh, cranked piece which we made a while ago. I think it covers most requirements. Quite pleased with that. The other thing, <laughs> a little bit of news. <laughs> yeah, guess what? Guess what? Lead screw and nut. There we are, 10 TPI. But I tell you what, I'm absolutely dripping sweat. It may or may not show on the camera because I just wiped my forehead again, but I am a walking Niagara Falls. <laughs> <coughs> Excuse me. So, I'm not going to be out here much longer and the uh, lead screw job is not going to get done until it's basically bearable out here. Um, the one other small thing I'll just mention before I close. I haven't uh, fitted this yet, but the uh, idea is to get more storage. So, <laughs> despite despite the colour mismatch, uh, I'm going to fit that fairly soon. Again, when uh, temperatures are better, I only need a couple of bolts at the top, but. Uh, that little draw unit was not used very much and I really, in, inside the cabinet, I haven't really got space for all the end mills and bits and pieces and stuff, so I think that'll be quite useful. Uh, anyway, I'm going to call a halt on that because the lead screw thing is going to be uh, quite a bit in the future, I think. When that's fitted up, I'll show you another time. So that's it, only a fairly short one. So whilst I go and cool off in the AC. <laughs> this is Chris signing off. Thanks for watching. Mm -hmm.